It feels like only yesterday that we did a Kanye West house tour, but back then he was still shacking up in the Mercedes-Benz Stadium. This time around, the man has actually purchased a real house, or at least that's what they're calling this boxy concrete structure. Located beachfront in Malibu, California, Kanye dropped a whopping $57.3 million on some new, eccentric looking digs to call hall. So let's check it out. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Kanye West is a rapper, singer, songwriter, record producer, businessman, and more, who's been a major influence in 21st century hip hop and pop culture. It's no doubt then that he's one of the world's best selling music artists, who's also amassed an estimated net worth of $1.8 billion. After the long awaited release of Kanye's latest album, Donda, it appears he finally left the Mercedes Benz Stadium where he was hiding out in. Despite his new Malibu pad being designed by an award winning architect, fans are throwing shade, saying the house looks like a parking garage and that Kanye loves the abandoned clinic look. But I'm gonna let you guys be the judge. Hey everyone, I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer bringing you another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment. This time, we're looking at Kanye's new concrete box. I mean, mansion in Malibu. Be sure to like, subscribe, and follow me over on Instagram to chat. Now let's get into this video. Since Kanye decided to visit Naoshima, the Japanese art island designed by award-winning architect Tadeo Ando, the rapper has been obsessed. He claimed this art was life-changing and once upon a time he even said he wants to live inside a sculpture. It seems that while he couldn't make that happen exactly, he's gotten pretty close. Kanye just dropped a massive $57.3 million in an off-market deal for a new residence in Malibu, which is half home and half sculpture it seems. Not to mention it's one of only a few properties designed by the famed architect Tadeo Ando located in the US. Kanye's new boxy style abode seems to be right up his alley with its minimalistic and eccentric design. The house was first offered at $75 million last year, so it appears that the rapper actually got a deal on the place, purchasing it off a of finance mogul Richard Sachs, also known as the ex-boyfriend of Ashley Olsen. While Sachs lived here, he dropped millions of dollars in seven years of his time to plan and construct this unique three-story home that looks like a military bunker to say the least. Reportedly, the building required 1,200 tons of poured concrete, 200 tons of steel reinforcement, and 12 pylons stuck 60 feet deep into the ground to support the massively heavy house and to avoid it sinking into the sand. It's located beachfront in Malibu, California, more specifically on a point 13 acre lot on the water of Puerco Beach. It has a large glass pivot door facing said beach for amazing views, along with the necessities like a spacious garage. Inside, Kanye's new residence stands over 4,000 square feet of space with four beds and five baths throughout. The lot is compact and squished between two other homes for the most part, but that's often the case with these beachfront homes here. At the front of the property, the two-lane street is often full of local surfers and beachgoers, considering it's a public beach with good waves. Kanye's new home has no yard and zero greenery, so at least the rapper won't have to pay for maintenance. While the concrete home was designed by a famed architect, fans don't seem to be impressed. One person on Instagram wrote, Kanye living in a parking garage, while another said his new residence looks like a high-end bunker for a cult leader. Among the clever comments, one fan even said that Kanye loves the abandoned clinic look, but I mean, after how he customized his former mansion in Hidden Hills where his ex Kim K is living with the kids, are you really surprised? That family mansion is like nothing you've ever seen, with the vibe of a mausoleum throughout, rather than an inviting family home. In my opinion, this Malibu retreat is nothing short of Kanye's style. Each of the three levels in the boxy Malibu residence offers a distinct purpose. The lower floor on the home has three ensuite guest bedrooms and the middle level boasts a common room such as the living room, kitchen, and a powder room. Looking at the home from the front, the exterior here looks more like a prison with no windows but a sliver in the center and a glass front door. Meanwhile, it's a party in the back since all of the walls facing the ocean are sheets of glass. I mean, I guess that's pretty cool. 
Now back to the interior of Kanye's home and you'll find the third and uppermost level is reserved specifically for him. The penthouse level also doubles as the luxury owner's suite which has a bedroom along with a gorgeous rooftop oceanside terrace. From the private roof deck you can take in the crashing waves below and elsewhere we can see another terrace that flows out from the home, boasts a lounge area around the fire pit. I'm pretty sure that's like the coziest thing we've seen at this house so far. Photos of the inside of Kanye's home are slim to none, but the interiors and furnishings have been described as minimalistic yet warm. I mean, I'm not quite sold on that, but I guess we're gonna have to wait and see. On another note, Kanye's new digs are only 30 minutes away from his former Hidden Hills compound where his ex-wife Kim and the kids are currently living, so that's definitely a convenient bonus. While Kanye is moving into that concrete mini mansion in Malibu, let's not forget he has another remote $14.5 million residence in Wyoming where he spends a lot of time. The ranch sits on 6,700 sprawling acres of land and has been the rapper's go-to spot since his impending divorce from Kim. Kanye bought one Wyoming ranch first in 2019 which cost him $7.7 million and spans over 4,500 acres of land, but he bought this second, bigger ranch only two months later. Located in Grable, Wyoming, this $14.5 million ranch is known as Bighorn Mountain Ranch and it's been Kanye's safe haven. While his first ranch, Monster Lake Ranch in the nearby Cody area, has been utilized to host public events, Sunday Mass and more, Kanye's second ranch is where he lives and writes his tunes. Interestingly enough, the Grable Ranch is only 50 miles away from the original one. This first ranch, Monster Lake Ranch, is complete with a mountain backdrop and grassy plains, while there's a ton of structures in the property. These include a restaurant and saloon, a ranch style event venue, a maintenance shop, an office building, and other ranch necessities like horse barns and more. Not to mention, there's even a state of the art shooting rate. Monster Lake Ranch also has two ranch manager homes on the property and eight luxury cabins, which fit up to 20 guests. However, the bigger ranch that Kanye spends most of his time at sits on nearly 7,000 acres of land and there are a total of seven beds and seven baths throughout the property. Bighorn Mountain Ranch, located in Grable, Wyoming, is known for its beautiful landscapes with canyons, mountains, and creeks. And if you prefer to arrive to the ranch via air, Kanye obviously has two heated helicopter pads for year-round access. His ranch boasts a main log home called the Lodge at Bald Ridge, which has five beds and four baths, and overlooks a large canyon and pond. The home is equipped with a wraparound porch to take in the views, as well as a wood-burning fireplace and a massive kitchen. The main living area is loft-like and fully wood-paneled, with soaring ceilings, skylights, and elsewhere there's a cozier den with stone fireplace, dining room, and sunroom. A lower level in Kanye's crib offers up an extra living space with another kitchen and bar. The ranch property also boasts three cabins that sleep four to six people with full bathrooms, so there's no shortage of space for guests. And right next to the main home, you'll find the cookhouse cabin. This outbuilding is complete with a commercial kitchen, expansive deck with views of the grounds, and sleeping quarters for two. Other features around the property include a walk-in sauna which is attached to the main house basement and outside you'll find an outdoor cooking area with fire pit and grill. The ranch also has an abundance of wildlife with an estimated 3,500 elk that travel through yearly and about 1,500 to 2,000 elk that use the ranch in nearby public lands. The creek on site, White Creek, is also perfect for small trout fishing. So that concludes this updated Kanye West house tour and what did you guys think? What's the verdict on his new Malibu concrete box home? Would you live in a home like this? I think calling it a home is a bit of a stretch, it really is more like a sculpture. Pretty crazy but I gotta say it's perfectly on brand for Kanye. Let me know your thoughts on Kanye's Malibu crib down in the comments, but I for one still prefer the Wyoming ranch. Thanks for watching, don't forget to follow me on Instagram to chat and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!